If you've got a MacBook with too little space and you want to expand that space with some nice solid state disk storage, here's a great option that doesn't even stick out from your MacBook. This video is sponsored by Podcaster Society. Join our elite community of podcasters for everything you need after episode one. Grow your podcast from average to amazing at podcastersociety.com. Hi, I'm Daniel J. Lewis from the AudacityPodcast.com here at CES 2016. I'm at the Tardisk booth with Adam from Tardisk. And Adam, tell me about the Tardisk Pearl. So Tardisk Pear, spelled P-E-A-R, is the world's first plug-and-play hybrid drive. Uh, up until today, MacBooks made since 2012 are actually completely unupgradable. There's actually no way to open up your device, open up your MacBook, and put a new hard drive in, put a new battery in, put new RAM in. They're completely closed systems. TARDIS Pair actually merges our fast flash memory with Ma a MacBook's internal hard drive. In effect, we create a hybrid drive um, that automatically manages file allocation. So instead of actually putting any other flash memory device in your SDXC port um, and having to choose, drag files to and from, organize uh, files, uh, you know, what we do is we actually take care of all of that for you. We automatically, we automatically manage file allocation so that you just plug it in, install it, and forget about it. So the result for me as a user is I plug it in my hard drive is now bigger. Right. I don't have two hard drives and I have to decide where Precisely. to put the files, but now it's just one larger hard drive. Um, are, is this intended to be permanent or temporary? Explain that, please. Good question. So TARDIS Pair is meant as a permanent installation. Now, we don't recommend unplugging the TARDIS while it's installed. It is very easy to actually uninstall TARDIS. It takes about five to six steps, 20 minutes, and you can just uninstall it and you know give the TARDIS to someone else or do whatever you want with it. Okay, great. So we're looking at expanding, and this could expand either uh, a spinning disk drive, like my wife has an old sure. MacBook sure. Pro that has a spinning disk in it, hard drive is filling up. RPM. Yeah, or I have a modern MacBook Pro with sure. an SSD that I thought I'd never fill up, but you know what happens with these things is that hard drives fill up. Absolutely. So how much space does TARDISK give us? Good question. So the, the the lower model is 128 gigabytes, which we sell for $148. Now our premier model is 256 gigabytes just on this little card, mm. and those sell for $399. Wow. So we're getting the advantage of fast storage. Right. And the great thing is this sticks in the drive and it's it's completely flush with right. the edge of the MacBook. Right. It's designed for MacBook. So don't think Windows users, sorry, this is really a Mac thing. But it, it's beautiful. It just fits in. It doesn't stick out right. so you don't have to worry about jostling or anything like that. The aluminum enclosure also matches the sheen of your MacBook, which are all milled here in or actually sorry, here in the US up in Boston uh, on a CNC mill, CNC lathe just the same way that your MacBook unibody enclosure is built. Nice, so it actually looks like it came from Apple, but it didn't, it came from Tardisk with their really innovative design. So tell me where people can go to find more information and purchase the product. Sure, so you guys should head over to www.tardisk.com, which is T-A-R-D-I-S-K.com. Uh, Tardisk Pair 2.0 came out this morning and they are available right now, worldwide, free shipping right. for everyone today. Great, and here's a question just, just that- today though. <laughs> here's a question then, um, that I, I, I have about this. So it's, it's essentially SSD storage, and SSD comes in, all, or uh, SanDisk, or sorry, it's essentially SD sure, sure. Uh, storage, sure. or SDXE, whatever you want to call it. Sure. But um, that comes in all kinds of speeds. Right, right. So what read-write speed do we yeah, if we were writing directly to this, or explain question. that, please. Good question. So, TARDIS Pair actually uses a file allocation system that caches its uh, its files back onto your internal SSD. So, when you install TARDIS Pair, the speeds that you experience are maintained, mm -hmm. and you actually end up with the same speeds, same read-write speeds as you would normally before installing TARDIS Pair. 
and that's done by a special file allocation system which is ruled by logic. Now, less frequently used files are moved to the TAR disk because, it, it, in fact, it is slower than your internal SSD. Now, more frequently used files, such as your OS or uh, any of your apps or files that you're using on a daily basis, which may be uh, projects that you're working on in, uh, for, for some sort of projects uh, you know, of, a of one month, TARDIS Pair actually realizes that you're working on those things and efficiently manages, that software, manages those files optimally. So that you always have the most frequently used files available at the fastest possible SSD speeds. Great. And then if we're writing directly to the uh, TARDISC itself, right. what is its actual rewrite right. speed? The TARDISC itself is limited to 95 megabits per second and uh, 9590 read write. So that's still about the speed of, uh, if I'm getting these numbers right, a class 10 UHS or U UHS-1, or, or yeah. So it's, it's a, basically the speed of a very fast SS or SD card. So you're still getting great speed from this. Really small, like the TAR disk, this is bigger on the inside <laughs> than on the outside. So tell us once again the pricing and where they can go for more information. So TARDIS Pair is available today from TARDIS.com, T-A-R-D-I-S-K.com starting at $148 for the 128 gigabyte models. And additionally, our premier model, which is 256 gigabytes, and which will probably double your, uh, your MacBook or even triple your MacBook if you have the baseline, uh, is available for $399. Great, so check it out. I'll have the links also below this video. I'm Daniel J. Lewis from the AudacityPodcast.com, and for the rest of Tech Podcast Network, thanks for watching. Visit podcastersociety.com to join our elite community of podcasters for everything you need after episode one. You'll get exclusive access to weekly webinars, a private community, video tutorials, members-only discounts on podcasting tools, real-time support, and more. Whether you're a hobbyist or a professional, Podcaster Society will help you improve your podcasting content, presentation, production, promotion, and profit. Grow your podcast from average to amazing at podcastersociety.com.